Today is going to be another reaction video uh, for the world record freedive. Uh, today is going to be by Italian for female freediver, Alessia Zucchini. I hope I pronounced her name uh, correctly. She is extremely accomplished athlete, uh, both in the pool disciplines and the depth disciplines. She has many national records, many world records, so extremely accomplished athletes. So this video we're going to watch on the Vertical Blue uh, YouTube channel. If you want to watch this video as a whole, it is a day number four or five of the competition which took place uh, this year in the Vertical Blue Bahamas. So if you want to watch the full video, the link is going to be in the description. But today we're going to watch only Alessia uh, Zucchini world record dive in a free immersion discipline. Okay, what we can see here, Alessia is preparing for her dive. She doesn't have fins. Uh, if you've done free immersion yourself uh, in, during the course, then more likely you was using the fins. I mean, you was not using the fins, but you have the fins. But officially, when you do the free diving competition, uh, the athlete doesn't have fins. So she also doesn't use a mask. She uses a nose clip, uh, no fluid goggles, uh, just a nose clip. So she uses these floating uh, things to support her legs in this uh, horizontal position. A lot of free divers believe they are more relaxed. Okay, she starts her dive after some packing. And as you can see, she do pretty intense like stroll pulls down. Because remember, at this moment, free diver Alessia Zucchini, uh, she is really positive buoyant. So she need to overcome this positive buoyancy, like just quickly pass these depths. So really strong pulls. Uh, I guess she is already, yes, she is already 20 meters deep. So she announced that this dive, 101 meters, is going to be done in 3 minutes 50 seconds. So far she is 30 meters deep and it's more or less uh, 30 seconds. So the average speed you can say about 1 meters per second. So she's still doing strong pulls, but now she also do some gliding. Right, as you can see, she pull and then she glide. Guys, what I want to uh, like specifically watch here is how relax your ankles. Like this is a perfect position for the ankles because it's uh, not creating any extra dragging. So she able to be perfectly streamlined because imagine your ankle is like more like this, like 90 degrees, then it's gonna be a lot of dragging. But Alessia, as I said, extremely good athlete, extremely good freediver. This is why her streamline just perfect. So her ankles, her legs really relax. Okay, she still keep pulling. Okay, now I think she done her last pull. It's a 60 meter deep and now just free falling. So if you are new for freediving, uh, then the free falling, it is when the freediver is negative buoyant and just like stop kicking, stop pulling, just free falling. Okay, what we see here, uh, let's remove my face somewhere here. What we see here is that Alessia is start spinning and I'm, I'm not really sure why. Uh, maybe because something of your body position, uh, maybe because there is some current, I don't know. Okay, she is almost 100 meter deep. Uh, as you can see, it is just like uh, she almost reached the stopper and uh, she ready to turn. Boom, she grabbed the tank. As you can see, she grabbed the tank and she put it under her hood because this is what later she need to show for the judge. And now it is a long way up. She's pulling strongly and uh, what she's also doing, what not all the athletes doing, as you can see, she pull and there is a little glide. So some athletes who are doing these extremely deep dives, uh, they don't have gliding. So they just pull and pull and pull and pull. And in her case, uh, she include a little glides. It's not a mistake, it's just like her approach to the free immersion. Uh, again, super relaxed, uh, like her arms, her legs, everything is super relaxed. She pull and then this arm extremely relaxed. Okay, she's still 70 meter deep, uh, still super uh, deep, looks nice, looks strong, uh, doesn't seem that she has any problems. Let's remove my face here. Strong, strong pulls, uh, already 60 meters. 
So her safety divers, I guess, is going to meet her about 40 meters. So just 15 meters to go. Uh, still technique haven't been compromised. So I guess she doesn't have a gas narcosis, uh, not hypoxia. Okay, almost 40 meters. Um, I may be wrong, but it seems that she start pulling a little bit like more frequent. Uh, again, I can be wrong or maybe she uh, start uh, having stronger arch to breathe. But no, here she's again start pulling more relaxed. Okay, here we can see her first safety diver. Uh, this diver uh, met her around 40 meter. So yeah, this is a first safety diver ready to react in case if there is any hypoxic event, uh, if there is a blackout. Okay, we can see that around 30 meters there is another safety diver. Alessia is pull, still pulling pretty strong. Okay, she's 20 meters below the surface. Two safety divers, I think the third safety diver. Oh no, this is a cameraman. Well, okay, and around 60 meters what she did, she removed the nose clip from her nose. Uh, why she did it? I think the main reason just to make sure that her surface protocol is going to require less steps because on the surface uh, free diver is supposed to remove facial equipment uh, before showing and saying okay and she did it early so this is why on the surface she doesn't need to care about this that uh, her surface protocol can be compromised so she removed the nose clips already uh, just 10 meters to go okay she do her final pulls she's a positive point now uh, he start, uh, she starts even kicking a little bit. Before she, she reaches the surface, she starts her exhale. She grabs the rope. Really strong. Doesn't seem uh, that she has any sign of hypoxia. And immediately, immediately she show okay. So there is no sign of LMC whatsoever. Just zero. Okay, she show okay. Looks fine looks happy okay now she's gonna give uh, she's gonna show the that you see uh, she's gonna take off she's gonna take the uh, tech which she grabbed from the bottom plate uh, from the hoodie and then show it to the judge she already did it or no oh i miss it oh, maybe i miss it oh no she did it now so she showed it to the judge uh, the judge shows a white card and now there is a celebration if you haven't seen my previous reaction video of another uh, free diver from Italy, Andrea Zuccari, you can check it out here. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, you can do it now.